Hello everyone. Uh, today I'll be presenting a quick walkthrough of Monyog. Now before we start, let's first talk about what Monyog is. Monyog is an agentless on-premise MySQL and MariaDB monitoring solution that gets up and running within two minutes. Now it is a cloud-ready solution and works well with all the flavors of standard and, My and hosted MySQL. With Monyog, uh, you can monitor your critical databases confidently rather than hunt hunting and pecking for speed with other monitoring solutions. Now, the moment you launch Monyog, uh, it takes you to the overview page, as you can see here, which gives you the full capture performance visibility across your databases. You get to see the total number of servers that you have registered with Monyog in case any of these servers are down, what are the critical alerts and warnings associated with each of these servers, and also, you get to see the top 10 running queries based on total execution time. With just a single click of a button, you get to see the relevant query details. So all in all, it basically, all this information allows you to avoid visibility gap and actually enables you to achieve faster issue resolution time. Next up, we have the service page. Now, the service page basically allows you to see the total number of servers that you have registered with Monyog. Um, one interesting feature that can be accessed by the service page is the disk information feature. Now suppose if you're trying to do a disk cleanup exercise, you can click on a particular server and just go to the disk information feature, which lets you drill down to, to the data, database level here you can uncover which database is taking most of your space, what is the total data size, what, what is the total size of a particular database, if there is too much of indexing here or not. So, so all this information is presented to you in a tabular format, which helps you uncover the information required to do a disk cleanup exercise. Now, one interesting thing to see here is that if you'd like to do if you'd like to drill down even further, Monyog allows you to do that. With just a single click of a button, Monyog, can t let, Monyog would let you drill down up to the table level. Now here, again, you can uncover the critical information required for you to figure out the top candidates for cleanup. Moving forward, we have the dashboard feature. Now, this is one of the most loved features of Monyog, as it has as it has all the charts that indicates the health of your MySQL environment. Any spike in these charts can be a good indicator of bad performance. You can look into these spikes and, figure, and see the relevant queries that were running at that point of time. This helps immensely when you're trying to look for the culprit query causing the issue. Now this does not end here. What I'm excited to show you guys here is the capability for our customers to roll out their own custom dashboards. So all you need to do is click on create new dashboards, select the parameters that you'd like to see in a particular chart. You just have to enable them and click on save. Now the reason that we allow, we provide this flexibility to all our users is because we believe one size does not fit all. And a lot of users, they would like to do a lot of charting and trending for a lot of matrices. So if you're someone who's trying to customize the environment which would suit their needs. All you need to do is create, roll out your own charts that would figure, help you figure out the health of your MySQL environment. Moving forward, we have the monitors page. Now, Monyuk gets shipped with more than 600 plus best practices monitors and advisors. Uh, now, the moment you install Monyuk and point these monitors towards your servers, it starts monitoring your critical MySQL servers and provides you timely alerts and advices before things go wrong. Now, these monitors are not just simple plugins. We have business partners like MariaDB who deploy Monyog on field, and while doing so, they keep sending feedback based on their experience, and that basically helps us constantly update and add new advices and monitors to Monyog. The best part about these monitors is that the underlying logic or code is not hidden from our customers. Everything is vis visible to you, as you can see here. And if you're someone who would like to customize these monitors, we give our users the flexibility to do, do that as well. Since the underlying code is not hidden, you can customize a particular monitor to your heart's content.
Great. So moving forward, we have the real-time monitoring feature. Now, this again is one of the most loved features of Monio because real-time monitoring is what you need if when you when you want to see what is happening to your servers in real time. I'll just load a safe session here to demonstrate the matrix that real time collects. Now, real time continuously executes a bunch of queries on your servers and fetches information. As you can see here, what are the top queries running at real time? What are, what are the most busiest databases, tables? What are the slow query logs for the particular real time session? What are the log tables, logging queries, and things like that? Since this information is retrieved in real time, you get to see what your servers are up to at any point in, in time. Now, a, real, a particular real time session can also be stopped and saved for later analysis. Moving forward, we have uh, the query analyzer feature. Now, it is one of the most powerful features of Monio because it lets you capture queries using multiple endpoints. You can capture queries either by analyzing the slow query log, the general query log, or the sniffer. Here, here's how the information layout looks like. So you get to see the top five running queries based on the total execution time. Now, if you want to do a non-obtrusive query analysis, we have something unique, which we call the sniffer feature. I'll just let the data load up. Now, basically what Sniffer does is it takes a dump of show full process list every single second and store it in our repository, which allows you to later run, run reports on that particular information, clean, clean up literals and group queries. So this information is again ga gathered by retrieving all the queries that is hitting your MySQL environment. Now the query analy analyzer feature easily uncovers the problematic queries so you can focus on queries that yields the highest value rather than shooting in the dark and waiting for the database performance to go horribly low. All right, moving forward, we have the audit log feature. Now in recent years, there has been a marked need for more sophisticated tools due to the increase internal and external security and auditing policies. Now, both MariaDB and MySQL implement auditing via native plugins. Now, these are fully, uh, these are fully configurable and may record database activities in a variety of formats. The resulting log file, when you click on show audit log, may be read directly or analyzed by a tool such as Monioke. Now, once you analyze the audit log, it provides you a summary of the failed logins, what are the failed e events, the schema changes, the data changes, and the stored procedures. And not only that, it also lets you view the fields such as the username, host, operation, databases, table queries, and things like that, all within an easy to read tabular format. So if you're someone who have a big, bigger DBA team and they would like to analyze and audit all the activities happening in your MySQL environment, you can use the audit log feature to track these activities. Moving forward, we have the talk track configuration feature. Now, Monio all also gives you the option to track and conf compare server configuration with Monio. Now, this is pretty unique to Monio, and no other monitoring tool in the market is currently doing this. If you have a set, now, I'll give an example. If you have a set of servers that are that are of different versions and some servers have performance problems, the cause could be the difference in the configuration of these servers. Now using Monio, you can see a side-by-side -side difference in the configuration of servers with a single flick. As you can see, there is a, on the top, top right corner, there's a button called show only changed values. So with just a single click of a button, you can see a side-by-side -side difference in configuration of servers. You can also track the configuration changes over a specific time range to see when did the change occur and was it expected or not. 
all you need to do, do is toggle between from compare to track and you get to see the information such as what was the latest configuration change at what time and when was the configuration change initially what was my oldest configuration change and what were my latest configuration changes now moving forward we have the replication overview now the replication overview feature basically allows you to view the replication hierarchy of your servers along with details of each replicated server to make sure that the data is always up to date at any point of time you can switch from a graphical to tabular replication view to get a deep dive into the running servers so this brings us to the end of this session last but not the least if you need a complete mysql monitoring system uh, with early warning mechanisms and is tired of using expensive unreliable monitoring tools download a free trial of monitor today we promise that you'll never look back Thank you for having me and have a good one.